hey guys welcome to forex family empire we're back again with another video it's your boy k smalls yeah guys so today i just want us to analyze the market for fomc that is coming and the fed interest rate that will be trading around nine o'clock today tonight basically let me just say tonight yeah so yesterday we analyzed this chart for uh cpi and then we said what did we say uh, regarding cpi we the market was somewhere here we said we're expecting the market to be uh going from here touch this zone and reverse from this zone so i was expecting sales anywhere from this zone to go down with the market so what's going to be happening during uh, F uh fomc and the fed interest rate that will be coming around nine o'clock let's see let's see let's analyze but guys all you need to know is that this chart is still relevant the way we analyzed yesterday as you can see we had a huge spike right there for us 30 even gold if i go back to gold i told you that gold will be going up from there as you can see this is my analysis yesterday i say when you see a breakout from here gold will be continuing to go up even right now here as you can see guys gold uh, i was expecting it to come touch this trend line go up but yeah that's basically what happened let's go back to us 30. i'll be analyzing us 30 by uh from now so that we can trade fomc together guys let's see let's see um so yeah this is where the market is at right now um what what happened right now is that uh I'm just, I'm just going to cancel this because the market already went up uh, the way we wanted it to go. So I want you to uh, specify the zone that we will be selling because I'm giving you the signal right now. The market will be selling uh, when when Fed interest rate is coming and the FOMCS comes. So the market will be selling and I want to be selling as well. So bear with me. I'll be trading with you as well. I might be live as well trading with you for FOMC and then let's see how it goes. So that's basically what I'm seeing here. I might see this triangle. Let's see also this. I want to see something here. What happened? Okay. I think this is this is nice. This is better. Better than the triangle that I drew there. So that's basically what I'm I'm going to be seeing. We're seeing the market bouncing here one, two, three times. It's failing to break out once we see a breakout we know we're going to be uh, continue to push down but if we don't break out from this trend line the resistance here or the support we might be seeing a huge uh, push to the upside before the news and then we can start going to the downside from this level guys i want you to i want you to specify this level it's three four three three four do you see it? 3434.56. Three, three, That's where the market will be turning if we don't break out from this level right now. I'm on a 15 minutes chart. Five minutes chart. We're seeing a rejection here. Basically, it looks like it's a it's a continuation. We're gonna be seeing a, a reversal from here if we don't see a breakout. So be careful on this on this zone, guys. So let's be careful on this zone. Uh, we wanna see the market basically giving us a rejection and moving to the top side before nine o'clock because this is the. Let me just delete this or let's take it to be small guys because this is the zone this is the zone that we are going to be selling our market at our FOMC this is where we're going to sell FOMC guys FOMC will be selling it here let me zoom in zoom in so guys do you see do you see what's happening uh, the music is making noise all right so yeah guys we don't break out from here we, we're expecting the market to come here and then we'll be selling put yourselves here let me also put this thing here so that you can understand that this is your zone of putting cells here this is the zone of putting your cells your stop loss will be somewhere here so make sure that the market when it touches this line you see i put my uh alert here that the market when the market comes here i want to get a letter so that i can put my cells even if it's eight o'clock seven o'clock comes and the market is touching this zone i'm gonna start selling so that when the fed interest rate and fomcs news comes uh i just hold and let it go down with me i mean 
that's basically what I'm seeing at the moment. The TP for this FOMC, I'm seeing it coming up to this. Uh, I'm seeing it coming up to this, to this zone, which is, which is the, what do you call the the, the triangle that I, I drew on the CPI news. So once it hit this. We're gonna be waiting for a breakout guys i don't think we'll be seeing a reversal when it comes here because we touch this this triangle a lot of times so this is a a very strong uh, uh support here so once we break out this support you can even hold your trade up until here so do you see this is the last tp that i'll hold my trade if i want to hold it up until friday or maybe thursday so that's basically what i'm seeing when it coming when it comes to uh, FOMC and the Fed interest rate today, but there's a lot of pips there, guys. Make sure you start selling your your trade from here. This is a very very huge level. Do you remember where this huge level is coming from? If I put it on D1, you will see where the huge level is coming from. Do you see? It's coming from here, guys. Exactly here. Do you see? I even took it up a little bit. I don't know what, but yeah. As you can see, guys, the level is basically here. We are next to that level. Let's take it down a little bit and see. Do you see where we're, we're basically looking at the we're basically looking at uh, this market trying to reverse from here. So guys, as you can see, the line I took it down, but yeah, my selling zone is here. Even here, we might have a selling zone, but it's not that strong uh, because it's coming from the D1. I saw it was broken multiple times. Do you see here? So it was broken multiple times. And then right now, I might say, okay, guys, if you see the market breaking this, you know you're going to sell here. You can sell here or sell here. That's basically your choice. But I put my uh, alerts here that the market, when the market starts uh, jumping into this level, I want to sell because of this trend line. The resistance is going to be hitting on top of that, where uh, we got also a spike from uh, cpi there so uh, once we got a spike there we saw a gap on top of the cpi the gap was recovered right now we're consolidating once we're done consolidating we'll push further more down this is the analysis for foamc guys don't forget and i'm going to also trade usd jpy guys uh basically usd jpy broke out today i'm expecting a strong uh, 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 USD when it comes to uh, the FOMC news and the Fed interest rate news. So we might see a USD JPY uh, pair going up a little bit. So, but yeah, uh, I don't know if I should analyze it. Let me know in the comment section below if you want me to analyze USD JPY for you and show you where you can be selling and buying your trades. Uh, so yeah, guys, I'm, I'm just going to leave it like that. I'm just going to specify my zones here as well as well at the moment and then i'll leave it like this you'll tell me what's gonna be happening here guys so it looks nice at the moment let's see how it goes 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 so yeah guys that's it from me i'll see you on another video bye bye